So I own a DR power grader that I tow behind my lawnmower because I've got a very long gravel driveway and the gravel's not that great. Um, so three or four times a year I gotta flatten it out and make it so it just doesn't hold water. However, I've lived here for about 13 years now and this road's never been good. Um, really, it's never been good. Uh, a lot of potholes and stuff like that. And unfortunately, whenever we complain, uh, the only thing they do is they put dirt on it. Not gravel. And this is what it does. I mean, these mounds are damn near eight inches high. You can see this is the macadam, that's how old it is. But that dirt is eight inches tall. And you can't patch holes in dirt. So all it does is when it rains, it washes out and makes big puddles. And it's just ridiculous. And I can't even, I mean, I've put my own concrete in this road when I can actually get to the pavement. But you can't put concrete in dirt because that's just stupid. I mean, look at this. I mean, that's just a lip there because of the dirt. And the center of the road is lower than the side, so the water never drains. It's just crazy. Uh, so, about the, as often as I do my driveway, I will come out here and try to do the street. But I've been gone from home for a fair bit the last six months, and I haven't gotten able to do it. And it got away from me. So now, I get to shovel all this horse pucky into these holes to try to break up these mounds that have have been created and then maybe I can get this flattened out a little bit but yeah I know my taxes are pretty damn low and the trash generally runs but this is stupid
Well, it ain't perfect, but it's better. And I don't feel like killing myself anymore to flatten this stupid road out. In another couple of months, it'll be just as bad. Especially in this area, because I didn't really get that full. But uh, at least now there's not too many ridiculous holes. I mean, hell, if the town had parked their stupid tractor at my house, I'd do this routinely for them. I don't mind. I just don't like having to kill myself because I don't really have the equipment for it. Anyway, such is life in the small town of Slaughter, Louisiana.